struggle has to carry on. This is simply one stage in that struggle, and that's how I think we have to see it. <laughs> Tory MPs have publicly um, have, have admitted that if, they, if, if their plans go through, there won't be an NHS in four years. So we need a struggle with the unions, with community groups. I think um, there's, uh, and that, that will mean not only protests and demonstrations, but probably will involve industrial action on a national scale to try and save our NHS. Okay, remind me of your name and who you, what you do. My name's Chris Moore, I'm the coordinator I'm of the Okay, and okay, yeah. how do you feel? Um, well, I was expecting this result, but I found it rather ironic that they were talking about the staff morale, um, because they have already mooted the idea of putting uh, wages by 15 to 20% in line with the pay cartel. They also told us at the outset that the staff were in favour of social enterprise and we found that they hadn't been properly consulted and I think it's quite significant that even today they were speaking of consultation but of engagement and I think that the battle um, has been won in this case but we've got a, a war to, to, to wage and that is to save our services and to defend NHS jobs, conditions and salaries and pensions and I think that, that is going to be the next stage of a big battle.